Hello and welcome to the premiere of Lanphier TV's Jam, the show in which various trending topics are discussed and panelists give their opinion. I'm your host, Miriam Farage, and on our show tonight we will discuss the NFL National Anthem protests, some Lanphier football, and pumpkin spice. Our panelists today are Alex McGinnis, Lauren Beam, Luke Southerd, and Alex Sheshul. So our first topic tonight is very heated. NFL players from all over are linking arms and taking a knee during the National Anthem. Some are even staying in the locker room while the National Anthem plays. Is this disrespectful or are they using their basic American rights? How do you feel about this, Luke? So, I mean, obviously we have the amendment to protest and obviously they have all that right to do it, but they should do it in a different way. Do you I think agree. it's disrespectful? I agree. I think it's disrespectful in a way, but I also think that it's their American right through the Constitution that they have the freedom of speech and the freedom of protest. So, yeah, I think it's disrespectful, but I also think that it's uh Should this be handled differently? I think Yeah. I think yeah. it should be handled differently because there are vets and like people who are sitting up there and watching and it's just like respectful to them to just do it, you know, for them and like saying it's kind of like saying like thank you and stuff like that, but I think it's good that they are protesting and doing it because there are a lot of issues right now with that and by them doing this like everyone watches so it's raising so much awareness. Yeah, I, I agree with Horan completely on that. They do should you, do it in a different way. Do you think what other way could they possibly do it? I think maybe take it to social media or something. sitting in the Extremely locker room and media. stuff. Like Extremely. I know sitting in the locker room isn't keen That's and even stuff, worse. But That's even worse. It's yeah. better than the staying in the locker room is not okay. They like, should not look at be the allowed Steelers. to do that. The Steelers didn't even show up. One guy showed up, and it was because he served in the military. How do you feel about the Air Force team staying in the locker room? That's like one of our four I, military they're services. They're completely. They're all active soldiers too, and they stayed in the locker room. I Isn't like that, that disrespectful at all. though? I, that is disrespectful completely. I also think it's good that everyone is kneeling together. Like more teams are doing that because it kind of unites us as a people. Yeah, last like, year I when, think it when Kaepernick us more. when Kaepernick was just doing it, it was kind of. Iffy just a because, slap in the face, yeah. honestly. Because yeah. yeah. it was just one person. But now everyone's doing it, and we're like all uniting and like saying like, "Hey, like this is our country." Like even though the government's there, like we run it. I like how everyone's unified. Do you think like the way that Donald Trump reacted to this was like fair or no? no? No, I think it was completely inappropriate. You can't get on television and call people those kinds of names, and it makes our country just look like a complete like. I joke. don't. It's embarrassing. Feel like they should be fired. I feel like they should be fined, honestly. Like, yeah, I, I don't agree. think it's okay to take players, away a man's livelihood, yeah. though. I don't think they should be fined at all. I think that it's it's their right to... Like, I know protest. it's their right. For sure. But I mean, they shouldn't be fined if it's a right. Okay, true. All right. Okay, all right. moving right along, our next topic is Lamphere football. Has Lamphere turned a corner? Is this season better than years past? And will it continue in future years? What is your opinion, Alex? Okay, first of all, I have all the <laughs> confidence in the world in our football team. We're three and two from an 0-9 season to ah. Jeff Glenn, who he brings this new energy and this new excitement to the team. Um, playing on the team, I think I can feel the change. I can feel the changes at practice. I can feel the changes in the game. Um, I have way more excitement about the game than I did last year. Uh, I'm. I like what we're where we're headed. Do you yeah. think it's gonna continue? Yeah, though? being a student and stuff like last year, no one really wanted to go to the games because like That's true. everyone was That's just so true. down about it. <laughs> and like true. now you you guys are honestly doing so much better and stuff. And even the student section is getting like so yeah. excited. Like everyone wants can, to go. Like we, we, we had tell. we had it's channel nine five five coming. Yeah, like, all the play football players come by us and get us all hype. I love. That's it. That's another thing. I love that, it. That I love channel nine five five. They would have never came last year, but this Absolutely year we not. all we all like united as a school. And yeah, Lakeshore is big, and they had they obviously had a part in it. But still, we we united as a school, and last year that wouldn't have happened. Yeah, yeah because I, nobody really wanted to watch the football team last year. It was more of a we just kind of excited didn't care. for them. My I'm, mom wanted I'm to watch. Excited it. for them. <laughs> 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 Our last topic tonight is less of a heated topic, but still quite important. The pumpkin spice season is back, and even more of a oh craze God. than ever. <laughs> overrated. What is your oh opinion God. on the pumpkin overrated. spice raid? It's overrated. I hate pumpkin overrated. spice. I think it's so gross. Leave latte alone let them but it's not even just lattes anymore it's like there's oreos cereals like I there's yeah. so much it's so much okay, more than wait, hear me out. the pumpkin the pillsbury pumpkin cookies are so good okay for, for oh so those are so good gross. anything by the pumpkin no, spice no, no, no. is just gross pumpkin pie it's just is so not good, good. <laughs> <laughs> i love i love anything pumpkin, pumpkin is gross no. anything I mean, other no. than pumpkin oh, pie pumpkin seeds are good 
I pumpkin's gross. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's all for this week. I'm your host, Miriam Faraj. Join us next week for some more intense and controversial topics on Lamphere TV's Jammed. Have a good week and get jammed. <laughs>